Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2. This is the Longland map. And last time around, uh, I'm pretty sure we spent some time getting uh, food delivery into uh, Hawkins here, right? So yeah, we got a train with uh, nothing on it because it's heading for the uh, food place. Yeah. So now the goal is to get the uh, food delivery is also uh, heading into Nowhere and Castle Rock. Now we've got the stations in place. So now it's a question of how do we get the uh, tracks in there to do the delivery. Now I had originally thought of splitting off of here and coming across to here and then maybe winding down to here. But... I'm thinking that's maybe not the ideal solution. Maybe. Uh, I'm not 100% sure on that. See, I could uh, come down around this way and uh, bring the uh, freight line uh, through Chester's Mill. Um, Temporarily, maybe on the uh, passenger track, uh, and then uh, split off here down into nowhere, and also, uh, hmm, yeah, I'd need to split off somewhere. Yeah, see, if we do that, we've got the massive hill there that we have to climb back up. I don't know that that's the right solution. No. Uh, I could also uh, peel off the track here and uh, link up here and uh, come in and, and peel off around here. Uh, yeah, I could do that. Huh. Right. So, if we were to uh, bring these tracks over to here, well, if I just parallel it even, yeah, I could just parallel it, come past the uh, station here, uh, and then come up the hill, and I could split the freight tracks off here into two, and we could pop under here and then up into here. And we could continue up, hmm. You know what, I'm going to try it. Uh, I'm going to try building something here. So we're going to uh, do this. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, that, that I think works. So, if we, uh, no, we can't do that. We have to extend this around a little bit. Yeah, okay. Now, can we get this? Uh, yeah, we can. Okay, so we can get the freight track out there. Yeah, we get a four track crossing there, but that's okay. Now, if we split the track, or if we share the track, I think we share the track maybe. Do we? Is that even a smart idea? If we share the track. Yeah, we can get through here and then we can get up. Actually. Okay. We could split under here. Oh, that might work. Okay, we might split here and go under. Ah. Uh. Hmm. No. I'm going to just merge the tracks here. Okay. Why am I coming this far? Well, uh, it gives me uh, a decent... Uh, um... Uh, gap there where we can park trains. So we take that out and that out. 
Right, okay, now we put some signals, like one here, and one here, and one here, and we'll put a pair of them here, yeah. Okay, so now we've got, I think we'll need another signal here. And then, uh, we're going to need more signals on here as we run up the, uh, the hills. Right, and then, aha, okay, so then we got to rejigger this just a little bit, okay. Rejiggering this just a little bit shouldn't be a problem, uh, we just need to do this. And, and this, and this, and this. Oh yeah, you need to slip that as well. Okay. Right. What does that do? That lets us uh, bypass the passenger station and peel the freight off going that way. And maybe peel the freight off. Ah, I think this works. Okay. And we can peel the freight off and go over top there as well. Okay. Good. So, can we get over this track here? Well, here's going to be about the best spot to do it. And we're going to want to go this way. Okay, now, so if we do this... No. Uh, if we do this... Um, Kill that. Right. Okay, let's try that again. We'll do this. Level. Okay, now we do this. No. That doesn't quite work. Okay. Okay. Well, if we come back from here and we do this. No, that's... that might. Okay, how high does that get? Not high enough. Okay, so we're going to have to come up a little bit. Okay, so how do we do this? Well, up... Uh... Nope. Up. No. Up. Yes. Okay. Right. Okay. Now, if we grab this. Nope. That one. Yes. Okay. So, because this one, we can angle it like this, and we can down bubble it, okay? Yeah. Do that. Okay. Now, can we... Aha! We can get onto it. Too much slope. No, we can't get onto it. Okay. If we back this stuff up a bit, though, we might be able to. Okay, try it from here. That works. Yay. Okay, so that one can do that. Okay, so we got those ones going up that way. And we also need a track coming out this way. Too much slope. Okay. Um... Nope, that's too much. Is that right? Um, let's try that. Okay. Yeah, we'll try that. Okay. Now, 
this one can go this way. Yeah, okay. That's way too much track work there, isn't it? Now, we need to come out of here. Um, if we come out like this. Oh. What if we keep coming out like this? No. Like this. Up to here. Level. Yes? Yes. Okay. Well, I think we can deal with that. Does that connect? It does. Good. Okay. Right. We bring this around. Yep. Okay. What do we do here? Well... We're not going to get... Yeah. It, oh! That's uh, flat. Okay. Um, good. Nice. Okay, so you can get these flat if you do it right. Yep. And then over here. Yep. Good. Well, that's uh, that's a discovery. Right. Now, we've got tracks into there. Right. We'll need a uh, one of these here. Yep. Okay. Now, that's in the way. So we'll take it out. Yep. Now, what do we need? Well, first of all, we need to get around like this, but keep it level. Yeah. Because I think that's what we need to do. And then see if this will connect up onto here. It does. Good. We can uh, we can live with that. Uh, okay. Done. No, you're not. Uh, right. Do this. Uh, now, you need to put a signal or five on here, right? Uh, you weren't kidding about a signal or five, were you? Yeah, apparently not. Um, where's the uh, signal there? Okay, yeah. That needs to be there. And I suppose your next trick is going to be running a train on here, isn't it? Yeah, pretty much. Now, where's the last bit of signaling going here? Uh, yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Right. So, we need two more trains coming out here. Uh, I think, hmm, is this, that, that just looks terrifying. Uh, right, where's the train on that line? Right, manage vehicle. Uh, do we have a, this is a Baldwin six wheels. We got to have a better loco by this point. Can we uh, replace this with something better? Um, we have the the Fairly 45. The Mogul does 75 with 400 kilowatts. Yeah, let's go with a mogul and passengers. This one, it does 60. 
That one does 60, carries 11 at four times load speed. Eh. How much are these guys moving? 36. Um, okay, let's do that. And uh let's uh let's just observe here we're coming out of castle castle rock heading for are we we're coming out of hawkins heading for castle rock okay now we'll see how it uh manages to move coming up the hill here Well, we are going to get up to 40-some at least. Okay, we're heading for Chester's Mill. Well, we could uh, up-tempo it. Yeah, that would make things go a little faster. Right. Okay, we come in here. Right now, we got our trundle up the hill. There's the other guy trundling down the hill. Well, we're holding 30 some up the hill. That's not too bad. And then we come up into the station. Okay. Wow, okay, I think that's uh, that's all working nicely. Good, right. There we go. Now, uh, what we want to do, uh, first of all, I want to check on what are we running here. We're running a Fairly and 10 boxcars, okay. Well, um, right, uh, I suppose, yeah, if we grab it from here, uh, steam, we'll grab this guy, cargo, that's going to be box cars, yeah, that one will do. And we're going to buy two of these. Yep. Okay. Now, um, do this. Uh, hide that one. Now, we're going to go on a new line, which will go from here all the way down to here. Yep. So that's going to be uh, dog, river, Food to nowhere delivery. Right. Now we go in here and do a new line here. From here to here. Yeah. So that's uh, going to be dog, river, food, to castle, rock, delivery. Yep. Okay. Well, that gets, um, what does that get us? Uh, something. Now, we're going to go up over here. And we're going to uh, duck in here and we're going to look at the terminals. Now, we have some terminals doubled up. Um, what if we put this one on Terminal 7? We broke something. Um, 
Manage line. What? Why can't it go to terminal 7? Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Oh. Oh. Oh, I see. Okay. We're missing a set of uh, points here. Switching whatever. Yeah. Okay. I bet you that makes it possible. Uh, close that. And what happens if we chuck in one more terminal can we chuck in one more terminal on here um configure uh tracks not up there we can't okay right well we can go over here on terminals and We can turn this to terminal 7. Yeah, nothing broke. And we can take that to terminal 7. Hawkins and nowhere. Okay. And uh, yeah, I think we can probably leave that as is now. Okay. Yeah, probably need to rejigger that station at some point. Uh, maybe add another set of platforms over on this side and change this dealy. Uh, not sure though what what to do there. Um, right. What I do know is we've got. Um, Dog River Food Spur. Oh. Oh, we need a uh, better capacity on that line as well. What are we running here? Uh, manage vehicle. This is a Baldwin. Um, yeah, we could run a uh, massive uh, train on here. Okay, so if we replace this, let's put a, let's put our uh, fairly here. Yeah. And what are we, we're running naffies, right? Yeah. Okay. Cargo. Uh, where's naffies? Naffies. Okay, and you're doing okay. Uh, that's okay. That's double the uh, capacity here. Uh, replace. Okay. Right. Now. Yeah, okay. So we obviously should uh, lengthen the uh, station here. Oh, we can go that far, can we? Platform. There we go. Yeah. Uh, right. Now, let's look at our uh, Nappies uh, train here. See, we can go with the longer train here. Partly because we have the long platforms, but also because we're single tracking, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, okay, so now we're going to pick up a boatload of stuff. 
yeah, that's going to move that stuff around a little better. I don't know if I've uh, mentioned it, but uh, I don't find the Naffy's wagons, uh, the Universal State cars here, to be uh, cheating. Because, I mean, we've got Universal uh, covered wagons. You know, it's exactly the same idea. There's no reason the same containers that you use on wagons can't be used on flat cars, right? Uh, so we're sitting here at the uh, tunnel here, uh, waiting for the Naffy's Wagons train to come out, right? Where is it? Oh, it's just about there. Okay. Yeah, there it is. Let's get a uh, look at these wagons as they uh, trundle out of here. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so uh, the Naffy's wagons are using these uh, buckets, just like the uh, uh, like the storage on the uh, platform, uh, you know, pallets. Yeah, so it's all uh, you know. So this is all perfectly plausible. Uh, so yeah, there's no reason why uh, it should be considered cheating, right? And uh, the Naffy's wagons have lower capacity than the uh, the, the uh, better ones, right? So it's nothing to be uh, particularly concerned about if you're worried about um, the uh, game balance, right? Uh, I'm using the Naffy's ones here because we've got food and uh, uh, grain going back and forth here, and it's kind of just a shunting route. So having two trains here just didn't seem not appropriate and, and having uh, one train with multiple wagon types didn't seem like it was terribly uh, useful either. Uh, right, so we'll up-tempo this and let it uh, get in here. We are getting a decent payoff on this one. So we're, we're taking a relatively small amount of food back and forth here. Uh, actually, what I want to check on here, do we have a better, um, uh, wagon here? Uh, we're doing five at 20. Uh, that's five at 20. That's five at 20. Yeah, we don't. Okay, yeah. Well, in that case... Um, right. We might need a couple more wagons on here. Okay. Duplicate. Yeah, we'll put a few more wagons on there. Just to move stuff more. Yeah. Right. Now, where's the... Yeah, the train's coming back. Yeah, we're, we're catching up there. Okay, so that's good. Right. Okay, I think we're good there. Now. Um, right. In here, we had the... Uh, Going for was it Castle Rock? Where are we getting a delivery to? Oh, over here. Um, nowhere. Yeah. Well, let's uh, let's see where this guy's at. It's carrying seventy. Let's uh, jump on board here. Uh, we're we're done with the project for this uh, this episode, so uh, we're just gonna ride the train here. Uh, and observe the uh, the path here. Now I think we've already crossed the river here, and we're heading uh, we're heading down, up, or up river, whichever way it flows. Yeah, we have. We got a fairly long haul here. Uh, I, I kind of like how the uh, rail network is uh, developing uh, in this uh, this uh, 
map here, uh, we've got uh, a fair bit of uh, long haul uh, trunking going on. And I kind of like that. It, uh, it feels more realistic, really, than the fairly cramped maps that you tend to get by default. Okay, so we're off the main line, and we're heading up to the Metroplex there. Into our tunnel. Right. Uh, it would be nice if they'd fix the uh, lighting uh, in the distance in tunnels so that it's dark instead of showing stuff but you know okay so now we come down into our uh, freight operation here okay, we pass under the uh, tracks there and we should be passing straight through here yep Then, we'll be picking up the main trunk here, local trunk. Right, and we'll pass through the passenger station here. Right, good. And we struggle up the hill, right? Yeah, we really are struggling up the hill. Okay, and we should be up to the junction here. And we'll peel off straight here. Yep, and off to the side. There we go. Okay, so that's working out. And we'll see what it looks like going the other way. You know what? I think that was the right call on the way to do that. Uh, the lay of the land here is not ideal. Uh, and that's that was kind of the point when I put the map together, actually. Uh, right. Okay, and we come on into the town. Good. And then we do the drop-off. Let's jump out and see what that gets us. 1.4 mil. Jump back in and observe it going the other way. This should run a little bit faster through the shared part. Yeah, there isn't really that much of an elevation change there. Okay, and then down. Now that's quite an elevation change that we have to go through there. And, oh, we caught up to the uh, passenger train. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, having a little bit of queuing on occasion is not going to harm anything there. Okay, now we split up, and we don't have to. Now we don't have the conflict points anymore. Right. Good. We're, uh, we're good here. Now, obviously, the rest of this is fine. Okay. Well, uh, that pretty much sorts out the food deliveries over in this part. So, the next, next up... Emerald City, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, Emerald City. And then we'll need a... Uh, 
an inter food hub exchange i think yeah emerald city yeah so we're we've got a main line here that's basically going the whole length right uh all the way up like this around this way all the way back down this way right so we've got a main line going but, uh, yeah, that's quite a uh, winding path it takes. But, you know, there's a reason for it. But we're going to have to peel off uh, coming up. Yeah, Raccoon City. I think probably Raccoon City needs to be connected up. Uh, and everything around Emerald City. Yeah. Okay, so that's that should be the next project. Get the food operations here uh, going. <clears throat> and I think think i've got an idea for this which should be kind of amusing so uh, we'll see if that works out uh not sure but it might and uh, we'll see anyway that's going to be all for this time so stay healthy uh, don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much uh, there's allegedly a light at the end of the tunnel and i'm starting to believe it more and more every day and of course you can like comment subscribe hit the bell or hit dislike even if you prefer, you know, your choice. Uh, you may get some benefit from one or more of those actions, or you may not. Your call, you do what you're going to do, right? And uh, see you back next time.